Vasilina was born without arms, and most people believed she would have a difficult life. But just seven years later, she did something surprising that will truly shock you. Life can be tough, especially when you don't have arms. That's what happened to Vasilina, who was born without arms. That made things harder for her. But that's not all. Sadly, Vasilina's parents couldn't handle the challenges of raising a special needs child. So, they made the heartbreaking decision to abandon their baby at an orphanage, hoping someone else would take care of her. It was a tough decision, but little did they know that something amazing would happen in Vasilina's life. The orphanage posted little Vasilina's picture on Facebook alongside a caption detailing her sad story. The post went viral, and it caught the attention of Elmira and Chris Knudsen, a Moscow-based missionary couple. When Elmira and Chris saw Vasilina's photos, their hearts were touched by the plight of this armless baby girl. The Knudsen's were parents already, of three boys, one of whom they adopted. But seeing Vasilina's photo, they couldn't ignore the feeling that she was meant to be a part of their family. Elmira and Chris came from very different backgrounds, each with their own stories. Elmira grew up in a Muslim family in Bashkiria, Russia, but her life took an unexpected turn during her university days. She met a British couple who introduced her to Christianity. Although she was hesitant at first, Elmira felt a deep connection to the message of love and compassion that Christianity offered. This path eventually led her to further her education in the United States, where she learned more about Christ and became passionate about helping others in need. Chris, on the other hand, was an American man who grew up in a Christian family. He met Elmira when she was studying in the United States, and they both wanted to make a difference in the world. The couple decided to become missionaries and volunteered at a cancer clinic that comforted mothers. They believed in spreading love and joy, which helped them build a strong, loving relationship with each other. Even though Elmira and Chris Knudsen came from different backgrounds, they both shared a deep love for children and a strong desire to help others. So, when they saw Vasilina's photo and read her sad story, they immediately knew in their hearts that they wanted to be her parents. Still, Elmira and Chris had a tough decision to make about adopting Vasilina. They wondered if they had the energy and patience to care for another child, especially one with unique challenges. They also wondered whether someone else could give Vasilina the love and care she needed. So they began to pray and hope that another, better family would adopt her. But something inside them kept pushing them towards Vasilina, something that resonated with them and even more strongly with one of their sons, Dinis. It turns out Dinis was also born without hands and without legs. And Dinis really wanted Vasilina to be his sister. Surprisingly, their two other sons, Radek and Aiden, started wanting a sister too, even though Radek was a bit more worried about her not having arms. As time passed, Elmira and Chris still couldn't stop thinking about Vasilina. They thought about the love and happiness they could give her and the great opportunities they could offer her. They realized that they had plenty of love to share, and they were ready to do whatever it took to make sure Vasilina was happy and well cared for. With hopeful hearts and strong determination, the couple made the big decision to bring Vasilina into their loving home. Despite knowing that it wouldn't be easy, they were committed to giving Vasilina a loving home. Elmira and Chris believed that with their love and determination, they could overcome any challenges that came their way. Little did they know the obstacles that were waiting for them would be plenty. As soon as Elmira and Chris began the legal adoption process for Rosalina, they began to face many unexpected challenges. One of the major issues was the fact that Chris was an American citizen, despite Elmira, his wife, being an ethnic Russian citizen and the couple residing with their family in Moscow, Russia, and their previous experience with adoption the court's decision remained uncertain. The couple worried until the very last minute about whether they would be allowed to adopt little Vasilina. It was a difficult and uncertain wait for Elmira and Chris. The couple had to go through a lot of paperwork in meetings, even though they didn't know if the court would say yes. Finally, after a long and stressful wait, the Russian court ruled in favor of Elmira and Chris. The couple were overjoyed and relieved that they could now become Vasilina's parents. They couldn't wait to welcome her into their home and make her a part of their family. Elmira prepared a special room just for her new baby daughter, filled with toys and books, 
eagerly counting down the days until they could finally hold Vasilina in their arms. Vasilina's arrival in the Natsen household brought both immense joy and new challenges. When Vasilina first came home, she smiled a lot, but almost overnight she started throwing tantrums. A lot of tantrums. They realized, though, that this was actually a good thing. It meant that she was getting used to her new home and feeling less stress from her time in the orphanage. Before she was adopted, she wasn't even used to being picked up. Her new mom understood that Vasilina's tantrums were important. They showed that she was adjusting to her new life and wanted to be more independent. Vasilina was learning to trust her new family and explore the world around her in her own way. As time went on, Vasilina's tantrums became less frequent and she felt happier and more secure in her new home. Her new brothers, Adon, Radik, and Dinas, instantly fell head over heels in love with their new sister. They couldn't get enough of her, showering her with kisses, pats on the head, and constant care. Elmira noticed how Aiden would always check up on Vasilina while she ate, showing his deep affection for her. Even when Aiden was away at camp, Vasilina would call out for him in a funny way, longing for his presence. Dinas was overjoyed as he felt he shared a special and deep connection with his sister, who could understand his struggles and how he had always felt different from everyone else. Together, they could look at each other and feel like they truly belonged. That they were not alone anymore. Baby Vaselina could finally see someone who looked like her. The competition for Vaselina's attention between the boys was fierce. When the elder two were not away at camp, they would fight over who got to be with her wanting to be by her side and make her laugh. Elmira observed this loving rivalry with a smile, grateful that Vaselina had become the heart of their family, bringing so much love and joy to each of their lives. With her family's loving support, Vaselina faced challenges head-on and showed incredible determination. Walking was tough for Vaselina. At first, she leaned on her head to stand up, but after a single step, she would keep falling over because of the lack of balance. However, she kept trying and eventually she learned how to stand up and take a few steps on her own. As the years went by, Vaselina grew older and she became even more amazing. She learned to do everyday things with her feet and discovered that she had a talent for art. With special tools, she started drawing using her toes and creating beautiful pictures that showed her unique perspective. But that's not all. Vaselina's curiosity pushed her to explore technology. She learned to play computer games using devices designed to help her. She became really good at it, showing off her skills and impressing everyone. With each passing day, Vaselina showed everyone that nothing could hold her back. She continued to surprise and inspire her brothers and parents with her incredible talents and unstoppable spirit. However, when Vaselina was seven, she did something that left everyone in shock. Elmira captured what she did on camera and uploaded the video on her Facebook page. People couldn't believe their eyes, and soon the video went viral. In the video, Vaselina used her toes to eat. She grabbed her fork with her right toes before slowly moving it towards her mouth for a bite. Whoops, nearly. Although the food fell off, Vaselina refused to give up and used her left foot to adjust the food on the fork before trying it again. And guess what? She succeeded. Everyone on the internet loved watching Vaselina's amazing video. They were amazed by her determination and how she could do things differently. People from all over the world were inspired by her and shared the video with their friends. Vaselina became famous in no time. Elmira decided to share another new video with the world. In this video, she demonstrated her remarkable progress and showcased her exceptional ability to eat, draw, and play using her feet. Vaselina's story is a powerful example of what love and determination can achieve. What do you think about Rosalina's story? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you for watching.